Here's a piece that's also from the Baroque era, also very early Baroque, considering the composer Joachim van den Hove died in 1620, even earlier than Schein from the Aleman that we just had. This is a piece called Canary. It's an unusual form in that the first four measures repeat, the second four measures repeat, and then the last eight measures do not repeat, but if you see here, they are the same notes as the first four, four measures. So this piece is really uh, an easy 36 points because really you're only learning eight measures. These measures down here are the same as this. They didn't even need to write it like this. They could have said DS Alfine or DC Alfine right here because this here is the same as that up here. It's very good to, to look at your music and study the form apart away from the piano. And uh, so we're doing that now together. This is uh, G major. I think all the last piece was in G major. Last couple, three pieces were in the, uh, this is the third piece in G major. We had the Sparrows and we had Alamon and we have Canary. So they're all in with one sharp. However, I don't think you have a single sharp to play in this piece and there's not a single accidental. So this perhaps is probably the easiest of the, of the 36 pointers. This uh, seems to be a popular early Baroque rhythmic motive, two eighths followed by a quarter, one and two, three and four. So this is uh, a, a lot of the echo effect, the loud first four measures and then they repeat the measures softly. And then here you have two measures loud followed by two measures soft, that it's this, almost the same music, a little bit different. Then you have exactly the same thing as up here, only with a retard at the end, poco retard. So here I will play for you Canary by Joachim, Joachim van den Hof. I'll leave the mistake in there. Maybe you'll find it kind of encouraging. It's embarrassing to me, but encouraging to you. Okay, here you go. There's Canary. Go for it. <laughs> 